the UFC featherweight division. Introducing first, hands five feet seven inches tall, weighing in at 145 pounds. 14 wins, one loss. He stands six feet one and one beat. Jerry Paul! Rob Hines, our referee for this one. The beautiful Brit being added to pay-per-view here during fight week. Let's see if these guys can take... Very aggressive. Closing that distance, trying to mitigate that reach advantage. It's the right strategy, closing the distance on the taller guy. Yeah, it certainly is. Zabit is elite. He's elite in his movements, elite in... One thing, though, you don't... Look at that side kick. You don't get into a technique battle Ooh, with a He's got fantastic striking. He's a terrible idea. But look how calm Zabit. Art, man. I think when you grow up in Dagestan, this is <laughs> nothing. Look, you asked, man. Right. Blood's in the water. Yeah, 100%. Ten straight wins. That, one, look yeah, that right elbow went down. That right arm immediately protected those ribs. So the experts to my right like the approach for Kyle Bokniak out of the shoot. The most impressive. Look at that. Spin into the right, the left hook. And then just yeah. relaxed. Seeing what's in front of him. Like a world champ on that too, baby. And how many times does Sanchai recover and land on his... Look him up, kids, if you don't know Sanchai, Sir Kingston. Mago match experience. And there's a big advantage with that. And look at all the head Ooh. that was there early in the fight. A lot of bomb, a lot of explosion. Look at the mark on the right side of his rib. Bokniak sticks the jack. So far, Bokniak... Jesus. Look at that. Jump and switch kick. That, you wind up on your butt. Bakniak is... If, if he had a better kicking game, he'd be able to work that left. Wrapped it right around that right ear of Kyle Bakniak. It's the way... Just light up. You want to talk about an underrated coach. Mark Hen Repertoire for Zabit. He has landed 16 and counting here in round one. This guy is so fast. And the hard part is getting ready for a guy like this. I need 145 to him on the ground. You're not going to find a guy who's as good as him on the feet and not. It's a beat thought about a late shot. Both guys connect in that exchange. This, for me, a guy who loves technique, this is a pleasure to do. And to do it, look at that. Wrap that left leg around the head of Kyle Bach. He starts to tee off. He doesn't like the pressure. But when you move forward, you've got to finish him with the third, fourth, and fifth. And let them off the hook. Body armor, more defense, natural, more electrolytes, defense. better sports drink. Grab yours at parts. You saw his previous yes. fight, right? So yes, uh, I'm something very behold, impressed. Man. And I was looking forward to this. Gauge it with your eyes in right. real time. You go, oh yeah, you're looking at something special. Game as they come. And Bakniak's corner advice wasn't wrong. Get in there. You right. have to was Bakniak just taking a page out of Max Holloway's book? Yeah, I, I think he did. He asked no on you. Yeah, look at that yeah. beautiful dog. Oh, man, oh man, strike. This is what's crazy about this guy. And when they're this unusually yeah. built. Look at that, kick that leg out. Yeah. Great oh, mat return. Great mat return. Body lock to double leg. A lot of people would have gone high and given that up, gone back to the clinch. It's in the octagon. Right. This is his third MMA fight in the UL class town. Right. Well, and largely a lot of the world class competition. Watching it at home, I was impressed. But we, me watching it live, it's the way they flow together. The people who really follow this sport were. Now it's on the main card. And again, I like the fact that. Oh. That's craziness. Pointed at his chin. Come get it. He, his wrestling's not as sharp. His punches are his main weapon. A lot of pride behind that. And what he does have is heart. Yeah. Unquestionable. Him him. Oh. Back yes. it up, right. man. Yes. Just want this over with. Kyle Bakniak does it. He wants to fight. Right. Hands down. Cocky. I mean, he's trying to. But look at this. Bakniak fighting off his back. Grabbing a hold of that wrist. That is. <laughs> I gotta learn that. That's what I said. That was beautiful. Going back to the gym. Armbar's just not deep enough. Hips aren't in the right place. Going to Maplata, but now that Bakniak will have to deal with less than a minute here to go round two. But like some a tough, tough dude, but he just doesn't have a well-rounded arm. When you have to worry about two weapons, your opponent has to worry about that right hand. Still trying to close the distance. Man. Oh! Forehead very badly. Look at Kyle Bakniak's forehead. And look at this mat return. Beautiful stuff. And look at this outside trip. A lot of fighters would be quitting, would be folding, would be thinking about their neck. I need to feet and straighten that fucking right hand out, Pete. Wait a minute now, right, Kyle? You gotta dip and then you gotta rip. Second Slip out. and rip, baby. Slip and rip. Who sits native? Kyle Bakniak, one tough customer. Get their fight. 
fighter tactically back in this fight. His heart's... You can teach a guy skills. You can't teach a guy to be this. Flair. <laughs> and now that forehand leaking pretty that. good Here for Bob. has a, a very, very strong mind. There's no question of disadvantage with a guy who's more explosive and crisper technically. And he ducked. Kick and shortened up on it. Bent his leg just enough to catch him on the chin. Go from this guy. I'm telling you, this fight is worth the admission price tonight. The Botniak thought about grabbing the fence there, thought better. The event. Why won't this guy go away? Kind of frustration. Right. He also, both these guys, unbelievably strong mentally. Yeah, I, I think very impressive. I want to see him against a top 10 contender next. <laughs> He's trying to con the referee into letting him stand up. He's in bad position. You know, denied. Just sticky with. Already 10 shots in this fight. A well-rounded overall game. It wasn't for the heart of Kyle Bach. Show us his full game. That's what's so exciting about this. It takes two. And Zabit stays right on him. Right on him. Peel that leg away. And look at Fuchsia on. He's got to pull him back to get anything done. Has to free his left hand. That arm with so one, hand. one hand. That's crazy. Yeah. Look at his third UFC appearance here tonight. He has been must-see. Pretty good level change there. Bakniak snuck. It's one minute in this third and final round. If Bakniak was going to turn, said Joseph, first time Zabit has looked human. Bakniak coming back. Deep breath from Bakniak. We'll see if he's got one final flurry here. Spinning. sitting down right now and they shouldn't be Woo! incredible tonight but you knew the beat was the real deal and you got to think box the nice. and here's the beat with a getting back kick to the chest and here's one of the this guy really truly is special he's pouring on with seconds to go absolutely and could you imagine if that had been the first fight of the night as we you got it you, we'd be referencing it every minute of this card all right there's buffer ladies and gentlemen 30 27 and 30 27 for the winner oh. thank you i want to say thank you to kyle bachniak and thank you to you right. thank you very much zabins tonight Забит. Я бы назвал это сегодня. Павел Кайл не простой соперник. С характером пять моих соперников отказались. Спасибо. In this fight, because five opponents refused to fight me. Well, but what you showed tonight is true technical brilliance. What? What did you say? Да. Face someone in the top ten, someone who's highly ranked. I'm sure. Я да. и Родригес. Be a phenomenal fight. Look, Zabi, thank you very much. Congratulations. That's three ball, ladies and gentlemen. Performance, but an unbelievable fight. Two warriors.